potatoes and this is just a shortcut when you don't feel like cutting up your own potatoes and making your own home fries it comes with the onions and peppers in it normally i add more onions but this morning i'm not going to i'm really tired <clears throat> having my coffee josh was still sleeping and i kind of just want to get going I have a lot to do today and I was not going to bring you guys another cooking video. I'm trying, I don't want to do cooking videos like every single day because I'm pretty sure you guys know how to cook what you want to cook. Um, as far as the oil, because these potatoes are small, I used one scoop of this. That's why you see it, um, you know, wet looking. One scoop of this out of oil and I'm letting it heat up now. And you know the burner is not even. That's why the oil is uh, resting towards the back of the pan. So generally I keep turning it around so that it cooks in different areas. I need to address that though. Get it even. Up. But uh, it's getting hot enough for me to go ahead and add my potatoes. This is the bacon that I'm using. And we get this from Costco. And the bacon is going to be going in the um, our air fryer. So you will get to see how it comes out. It comes out nice and evenly cooked. And I, that's why I like it. And I could kind of set it and forget it. Same thing with the potatoes. Once I get it in there, get it seasoned, I cover it down. And just put it on the temperature. And go ahead and... You know, enjoy my coffee, check my emails and things of that the air fryer. I've already laid the bacon on there. And this air fryer is the one that's old on TV. It does um, come with several shelves, so I could cook several things at one time. Now, they don't have bacon on here, so I generally just use the fish because it gives me 15 minutes. And then I just let it. You set it and forget it. I don't even have to flip it. I may flip it, but I don't have to flip it. All right, and then we're gonna go back to the potatoes now. And I'll let you guys see how that's coming along and how long it took for it to get as brown as it will be. And it's 8.08 in the Okay, day. the oil is ready to go. Um, you have to have it kind of hot because these frozen potatoes are going to be too slow. Here's to me. And then I'm going to go ahead and uh, throw my seasoning on it and let it cook out. And then you just keep tossing it because they're kind of free cooked in a way, if you will. I'm putting some accent on there. Yeah, I know that's my little staple. Definitely nature, so I'm putting some nature on there. Definitely garlic. Yeah. I like the garlic. I can't put too much pepper because uh, Joshua likes these as well. So I really don't put like a that. That's it for that because it can. And then I'm going to mix it up in one moment. It up so the seasoning can get through there as well and then cover it down Ooh, me. Pepper getting some, and let them go ahead and start softening and then I could flip them back over but now you see why I didn't use that much oil you don't want it to soak up a lot of oil and I'm going to go ahead and cover it I have it cooking on eight Meanwhile, let me let you see where about. I put it in that what? Oh, I thought it was 806 uh, with the bacon, but it must have been 802. But let me show you where it is so far. Okay, I'm going to turn the light on in here. Oops, sorry. I'm going to turn the light on. So you can see. 
and you see how fast it's already have this bacon popping and all the grease will drip down into that pan down there and it will cook it evenly, evenly so I don't have to worry about coming in here and flipping it back and forth and right now it's done that and it's 11 minutes out of 15 so far and for those of you wondering how air fryers cook as you can see you still see the grease get created and it does go down to the bottom but the food cooks awesome and please know that all air fryers are not equal they are not the same you have different versions that came out since they introduced this large one on tv and it is large but it comes with a lot it comes with a lot of stuff we also got a pressure cooker cooker with it we have a rotisserie thing that came with it so you can rotisserie chicken a whole chicken um there's a seafood basket so you can do shrimp and things of that nature and they do come out crunchy as though you deep fried it so um my mom had tried one from brand smart and did not like how the fried fish came out and took it back <laughs> and i told her it was not the same one as this one so they are not all the same um i know they have some with like this little basket at the bottom here and I don't know, they just don't cook the same. So just be mindful of that and let me, let's take a look at our um, breakfast potatoes or home fries. See, they are cooking away. And we'll have that much. Now I like mine to have a little crispiness to it. Like I could turn it off right now. And I may, cause I keep forgetting a portion of it. Joshua's going to eat as well. So it's better soft for him. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go ahead and turn it off and let it finish cooking with the heat. Because you know, I say it all the time, electric continues to cook. I'm going to go ahead and put my bacon back up and then get my plate ready to eat until my little sweetheart wakes up. <laughs> Okay, as you can see, 15 minutes would definitely burn this up. It would not. Let me get close enough. Um, I'm going to go ahead and cook it a little more. Here's a piece here. Look how it did that fat. So good. And I'm going to take it down to one minute because it cooks a lot within one minute. By the time it goes, you know, cools off and goes to the off position, uh, I probably will have to take it off. Mm -mm -mm. That is so good. I just ate that little piece right there. It's so good. So, while that's finishing up, I'm going to go ahead and plate my potatoes. Okay, it's beeping that it's finished, so it's in the off position. And let me let you see how it looks. So, all I can do is just put the you know put that dump it on some paper towel and let the grease on the top soak off which is what i'll do okay i'm all plated there you have it nice crispy caramelized bacon my little home fries and my coffee which is almost about done so i'm gonna go ahead and re-up on that until we come to our next segment hope you guys enjoy didn't even take me 15 minutes honestly <laughs> 